Carlos Alcaraz has warned Novak Djokovic and Rafael Nadal that he's eyeing the world number one spot and is hoping to challenge them for it. The 18-year-old became the second youngest man ever to reach the Miami Open final and has a chance to become the tournament's youngest winner on Sunday. Alcaraz has enjoyed an impressive start to the 2022 season, losing just two matches so far at the Australian Open and Indian Wells. He became the youngest ever ATP 500 champion when he won the Rio Open in February and could become the youngest champion at Masters 1000 level by defeating Kasparud in the upcoming Miami Open final. The young Spaniard has already exceeded even his own expectations for the season, initially aiming to crack the world's top 15 by the end of the year, a feat he will achieve when the rankings update on Monday after his run in Miami so far. He has the second highest winning percentage on the tour this year behind Nadal and is now readjusting his goals after a stellar start to 2022. Having initially eyed the world's top 15, the two-time title winner has now set his sights on the very top of tennis, sending a warning to current world number one and other top players including Nadal that he was trying hard to reach the top of the rankings. My dream is to be number one of the world and that is my motivation, the world number 16 admitted after confirming he would be playing at Queen's in the summer. To reach my dreams, to reach the number one of the world. I'm trying hard every day for that. Alcaraz also shared his strategy for keeping a strong mentality, giving some insight into how he will go about his quest to reach the top spot of the rankings. Giving his advice, the 18-year-old said, stay positive all the time, even when things are not going well you have to be very positive and for sure things change. Alcaraz has already broken some of Nadal and Djokovic's records, beating them out to become the youngest man to make the semi-finals of both Indian Wells and Miami, the Sunshine Double, in the same year. Both Nadal and Djokovic were 19 when they first made back-to-back -back semis at the two American Hard Court Masters events. While Alcaraz is a month older than Nadal was when he made his first Miami final back in 2005 but the current world number three lost his final to Roger Federer so the younger Spaniard could achieve something his predecessor couldn't.